The glide slope gives you your descent guidance. The localizer gives you your right-left guidance to get to the runway. But how do you know how far away from that airport runway you are? If they have DME on the localizer, and some approaches do, and you have DME in the airplane, then you can get DME readings to tell you what your position is and how your progress is. But the more common way to do it is by marker beacons. And what marker beacons are is little low-powered transmitters located along the approach course as you're flying into the airport runway on the localizer. And by telling which marker beacon you're flying over, you know approximately how how far you are from the airport runway and how you're progressing as far as that approach is concerned. Now there are two marker beacons that are standard on an ILS approach. There is one that is optional that you sometimes find but very often do not. The one that's furthest from the runway is the outer marker and when you receive that on the marker beacon receiver in your airplane it's going to have a blue light. It's going to illuminate the blue light. The one that is closer to the runway is going to be the middle marker. By the way the outer marker will usually be roughly five miles out. The middle marker, which is closer, is going to light the amber light on your three light marker beacon receiver. Those two are standard and you would expect to find them on an ILS approach. Some approaches have an inner marker at it. If they have an inner marker, it'll be right about at the threshold of the runway, but not very many of them have it. And the inner marker, if they have it, would light the white light on the three light marker beacon receiver in your airplane. So what are you going to see in here as you fly over these marker beacons en route to the runway? When you fly over the outer marker, the blue light will go off, and what you're going to hear is dashes. When you fly over the middle marker, the amber light light will go off and what you're going to hear is dash dot dash dot dash dot. If they have an inner marker, when you fly over the inner marker, you're going to see the white light go off and you're going to hear a series of dots. 